what's up guys welcome back to my channel welcome back so today I'm gonna teach you how to make a beat on FL Studio 20 using Amosphere so first you want to install Amosphere first you want to get the software which is this right here Amosphere 2 and then install it into your computer which is pretty easy it comes with a card as you can see here comes with this software card and then it comes with the, the keys registration keys and then what you do is you just install the program and activate it I mean the software and activate it and then here I go to um, IFL Studio right here as I have it pulled up right here and then if you're a beginner I want to take it step by step and I want to show you how to do it um, up here you see this little icon right here you click onto the channel rack which is this and then you want to go to this plus sign right here down the channel rack next to all the snares and the claps and all that um, you want to click on atmosphere well let me show you again from the beginning let me delete this okay so you go to this plus sign to add atmosphere into your channel rack, you click on this plus sign right here. You go to Atmosphere, which is right here in the synth. If you have it already installed, it should be right here. And you click on that. Here, I have Atmosphere pulled up. And then on Atmosphere, you can click on any sounds you want over here. I'll click on the keyboard. And I just select one on the keyboard. Okay, that one sounds good. Okay, now once you have the sound picked out, okay, you go up to the uh, the piano roll which is this icon right here click on that and this is where you're gonna lay down the keys the chorus okay so what I have already available is I have the the unison MIDI chord package that's already available for me and I'll just go to one of this minor progression chord right here I'll pick it and drag it and drop it straight into the piano roll, which already you can see, I dragged and dropped in there. I'll play it out. You guys can see. Whoa, it sounds pretty harsh. Hey, yeah, Woo. that sounds good. Hey. sounds fresh so you see you see how simple this is just get the uh, unison mini chord package it will make your life so much easier so that's it right there that's pretty simple you can make the leading sound and then oh, let me stop that real quick and then you go to you go back to the <clears throat> the pattern laid out right here which you can access is uh, on this icon right here this is it and then you want to go to pattern number one which is up here and then you lay out pattern number one on track one I'll lay out eight bars right here and, um, and then here you can you know lay out the, the, the drums and then all the other sounds to so complete the beats you get what I'm saying <clears throat> okay so that's 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 pretty much it if you like this video hit the subscribe button and then hit the bell button you know what I mean support me please um, okay so I got this uh, course laid out on the track hey.
this is a leading sound if you want to add drums you can hop back over here to the channel rack and add drums later Drums. like this one right here so I'll just drag it and drop it right into the, the kicks and you want to go up to pattern number two because you're laying uh, you're laying the kicks now um, I'll pick up the kick right there you can pick a hi-hat I like this one and then you want to pick a snares it and drop it in so I'll lay down the, the kick first let's see how this how this sounds so you get the concept it's basically you just lay down the drums and then you change the pattern and then lay it out on the channel uh, the rack it's pretty simple um, Yeah, so that's basically that's how that's how it's done. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it could be a little confusing, but I will come up with more videos to explain you guys how to do it in details. But right for right now, I'm done for right now. So I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.